automotive department will take students and train them in the automotive repair industry. We start with the basics, how things work, how to repair things. We cover all eight areas of the ASE certification. Once they're done the first year, they go on to the second year and they get advanced training in fuel injection and emission controls and different electronic engine components that are really popular on today's cars. We have collision, we have a street rod program, we have automotive program, and a diesel program. Our industry changes, we've kept up with the changes, and so for students to look to us for training, it's probably one of the best training uh, facilities in the nation. We have over 100, 110,000 square feet, and we have millions of dollars of training equipment. The students will get a grade A education here in any of those fields. What I like about the program is they get into all the technical details of what, how a car works and they, they work with you hands on and they make sure that you, you understand how it works so when you get out into the field um, you're not unsure what, how things work. They try to help you learn here in this program is not be a, a parts, parts swapper, it's to diagnose the car correctly and and fix a car only what is broken. Since coming to UVU and going through just the first year automotive refinishing program, I've learned so much just uh, in the non-structural repair, which is the course I went through, that I, I went and had, I had several jobs in the automotive industry because, because of what I learned at UVU. We pride ourselves here at UVU in the automotive department that almost every aspect of the student's training is on a live application. It's not just a pseudo part where we wheel it in, they take it apart, put it together, it doesn't matter if it runs or it doesn't. Everything they do has to be as if it is a live project and most of these are live projects. You'll notice behind me cars. These are live projects. They have to run, they have to go out and they're going to be on the road. We thoroughly enjoy and, and really work hard at the hands-on training part. What I cover in the classroom, we come out in the shop and, and try to implement those things we covered in the class. So yes, it's definitely a hands-on training facility. As a whole, this university is, what a great job. We have a great facility. The university, we're part of the engaged learning, and that is just a showcase of engagement, of getting those students involved. Every year we've had this Auto Expo, and it is sponsored by the Automotive Department at Utah Valley University. The key issue with our Auto Expo and, and since inception, we've always wanted to have this be a, an opportunity to give scholarships. So all the funding that comes in, all of the sponsors that donate money, all of the people that come to the show and pay to get into the show, all of those fees go toward student scholarship. Somebody came up to me and asked me, what do I like about UVU? Or, should I go there? I would definitely very positive. They've helped me in my education so much. If I've had a question, uh, no question is, is a dumb question. They help you. They cl they clear up the information. They teach you what you need to learn to for this field, for the automotive field. I would definitely recommend UVU to anybody who wanted to come learn about the automotive program. They're one of the best out there. They're willing to help anybody on any level and they're just a it's just a fantastic place to learn about the automotive industry.